Hi, my name is Brooks. I run a brand called Nowhere Land, and this is episode four of Going Nowhere. I'm still not comfortable filming myself outside in public, so I'm trying to do this as discreetly as possible. Today, we are outside Fire on the Mountain, possibly the best wing spot on Earth. Definitely the best wing spot in Denver. I've got some art hanging up in the restaurant. We're going to go inside. We're going to get some wings. We're going to check out the art. But before we go inside, let me tell you a little bit about Fire on the Mountain and how we got here. This is so awkward. I'm crouched down on the ground trying to film and not be weird. There's so many cars and people passing by. I don't like it. But there it is, Fire on the Mountain. Oh, I got a microphone too. Look at this thing. Pretty cool. <laughs> Where to even start? I've been going to this place since I was in college. They started in Portland, Oregon, and they have a couple locations here in Colorado. It's one of our favorite spots to get together and hang out. While I was building my freelance career, it was always one of my goals to work with them in some way. And over the last couple years, I've had the opportunity to not only hang art in their restaurants, but also do some freelance work for their Colorado and Portland location. And needless to say, it's been an awesome opportunity to work with them. If you have a rad coffee shop or restaurant in your city that has a gallery wall, I suggest reaching out to them. It's a great way to get your art in front of people in a more casual setting. As always, the first part of every project is the artwork. It's important to take into account where the location is and what kind of location it is. In this case, I'm hanging up art in a restaurant, hoping to catch the eye of your average person walking in to grab some food. I'm going to take a bunch of my digital art and make canvas prints out of it. I use a company called Easy Canvas Prints to get everything made. Secondly, where is the location? I live in Colorado and this gallery wall is in Denver. A lot of outdoors and wildlife and a lot of Colorado pride fit right in with this demographic. We got all the prints in, so our next step is to actually prepare the canvas for hanging. Fire on the Mountain uses a wire system for hanging all their artwork, so I can't use the regular back of the canvas. I got this wire kit from Amazon. It came with all the pieces you needed. I just needed a wire cutter, a pair of pliers, and a drill or screwdriver to put everything together. Here you see me getting this first canvas all set up. I'm going to go ahead and do this to all the other ones, but you probably don't need to see that. Now that we have the art prints all done, it's time to break out the power tools and make ourselves a custom pegboard wall that fits within their hanging system. I want to be able to offer other products outside of just art prints within this gallery wall. My whole goal with this project and my company overall is to make my artwork available and approachable to as many people as I can. With the pegboard, I'm going to be able to hang up stickers, pins, patches, socks, and beanies to give people not only a product range, but price range to shop with them. finished up the pegboard and here's a quick shot of it so you can get a feel for how the products are displayed on it. We got all the art babies loaded up in the car and we drove over to Fire on the Mountain. They asked if I could come over after they closed up for the night to drop off the prints. That way they either had time tonight or tomorrow morning to hang everything up. I feel like I'm on some super secret uh, spy mission, dropping off some package in the night. It's not that, it's not that exciting. So let's go drop off the goods. I definitely thought my phone was recording that whole time while I was dropping off the prints. Turns out I didn't actually hit record, so I was just talking to nothing. And I didn't get any, any film. The package has been delivered, mission accomplished. I'm gonna come back in a couple days to get the crispy footage. So for me, it's gonna be a couple days. For you, it's gonna be a couple seconds. So check out the goods. watching and checking out this video 
It's been a rad opportunity to be able to work with Fire on the Mountain again. If you happen to live in the Denver area, for the entire month of September, my art and products will be hung up at their Wash Park location, which is right here. And then for the entire month of October, my art will be moved to their Highlands location, which is right here. If you want to shop in person, swing by, grab some wings, get some art. I'd appreciate your support. If you don't live in Denver and you want to shop some of these products online, the link to my website is in the description below if you want to check it out. I hope you liked the video. Like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, leave a comment below. I would love to talk about art, design, making products, or any other weird stuff you might want to talk about. I'll catch you in the next one. Thanks. Oh, 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 oh,